and welcome to Planet Coaster. I'm back in the collaborative park and I'm joined by Completely Average Gaming and we're going to take a quick look over the Terra Nova park that we started, was it about a month ago, I guess? More or less. Yeah, we have made some progress, so I, we went through this on Completely Average Gaming's channel last time, but he has done this awesome little bus park at the entrance. So those not coming by their own car, probably where you get all the, the coaches park up. We've got this nice little, nice little park and turnaround section, and I do like the little the little tunnel that goes to whichever town would be close by. Yeah. So I think that's all lovely. So I've been working on my first themed area, and there we go, the grand, the grand. Um, the Holy view for smokes. it. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, my section is the UK. So I started with this view. So I know we've talked about this before, but we we started with like you needed some kind of view here. So um, I've got the um, London Bridge that I've recreated, and I'm, I'm pretty proud of that. I've probably gone a bit mad with the flags here. There's probably it's probably a bit too too many too many <laughs> British flags. It's scaring me a little bit. There's probably too many of those. Proper patriot. Yeah, but it's a little bit too uh, patriotic there for me. So I may have a play around with that, or I just have to get used to it. This little bit here. So I extended the lake out and trying to get that bridge flat. Oh my goodness! <laughs> it's I, I, I had to like try about 15, 20 times to try and get the the bridge to go flat. It goes a little bit icky here and dips down, but I'll, I can probably delete the path from there. But this bit here, I am actually, I, I just love how flat it is. It's amazing. So It's so difficult to do as well in Planet Coaster. I try to elevate some of the building behind it because all about those sight lines and the sight line with, yep. the, with the structure at the back wasn't great. So... If we run through here, actually, I'll show you the train station first. I've just ruined the surprise there. So London Bridge, this is the old, if I walk back this way. So the train that comes through from the entrance, that comes all the way through here. And we actually have our first stop in the park, which is... I, like you sent me a, you, you sent me like a screenshot of this and I was like, Oh, that's that's amazing! It's so and, and you went so detailed with it, and then it, you, you were like, uh, "So I really struggled with the station." I was like, "Station? <laughs> you crazy?" <Yeah. laughs> it worked out perfectly actually because the, the the width of the station is exactly the width of the bridge, so that bit wasn't too much trouble trying to get the stairs in though. So if we run around this bit here, those stairs to try and get them straight was an absolute nightmare, absolute nightmare. But I managed it. And I think it looks pretty great. I completely agree. So, I'll run back to where we start. So, you walk through this way, and this is your opening into the UK. Uh, I've got like the tiny little, sort of like little, you know, town square at this section. And I really love, I've um, changed the fence in here so that you've got a nice little quaint sort of you sit down bit. Yeah at the back of the back of the station and I, I love the fence in here just just that little detail to, to add to the fencing I think that's looks really nice uh, around that section here um, again I've put in some general buildings so I wanted to have sort of UK architecture in this as well so I went with sort of Victorian style so this is meant to be like a sort of like a Victorian warehouse mm -hmm at the side and this is sort of kind of Tudor -ish. it's very basic for this one I mean I've done Tudor architecture before and it's a lot more detailed and in depth this one I've kind of just done like the base of it so it's something I may go back to and try and beef it up a little bit more I did also put in a little fish and chips shop which I think is very 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 <laughs> British and around the back here is um, a sneaky little washroom Ooh. so that we've got an excuse for guests to actually have to come down this tiny little road and I kind of base this on I, I've been to York and they, the streets in York are exactly like this 
So I thought I thought that was quite a nice touch on that section there. Um, I have put some rides in. I haven't themed them just yet, so I, that's something that I will get to. But this this at the back, that's uh, Buckingham Palace. So I wanted I wanted to put Buckingham Palace in because when I very first played this game, the first thing I did, I made an entrance based on Buckingham Palace and it was kind of sketchy because this was like when the game was very first new. I mean, I didn't play it when it was an alpha, but as soon as the game launched, that's the first thing that I built. So I thought that'd be a nice thing to revisit and just try it again and do it better. And I think I've done a better job this time of mimicking Buckingham Palace. I just realized how screwed I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you'll be fine. You will absolutely be fine. So the inside isn't done yet, so we can have a little look in here, but this is, this is where the um, the illusion is lost <laughs> when, with all the with all the people. So that'll all be covered up. And I think we were talking before, what I might do is I might do a live stream um, in a week to try and get this finished off. I think that might be a nice idea. And the other section I did put in here, um, I kind of put Stonehenge on a hill, <laughs> so... <laughs> It's just it's just a, just a tiny one. It was like play, playing around with the um, the stone pieces in the game, and I thought, well, we, you've got the opportunity to do it. Why not? Why not give it a go? So it's kind of kind of a little bit of light theme in there. I do quite like the way the ride cars like you go over the rooftop. So it's kind of it's getting a bit Mary Poppins <laughs> at this point. So <laughs> I have to have some broomsticks and all sorts. Just like you know, put some theme in around there that that mimics it. So. What I could do actually is have some smoke coming out of the, the chimneys there. That might might be a good idea. I think that would look kind of cool, at least from some of them. I you probably get a really nice view as you come out of here. You get to see the you get to see the bridge, and I, I forgive me, I forget the name of this ride, but I thought why not have some planes shooting around and have the yeah. have the cars. I mean, it's it needs this needs smoothing so much. Just looking at it now, it's it's just that I need to play around with the ride so much more and get this working. But I think for a starter, this isn't isn't too bad. We've got, as I say, we've got the um, we've got the bridge, we've got Buckingham Palace, we've got a nice little village going on here, and I have done some theming. It's just not finished. I realize you probably can't tell, but I'm like sitting here with my mouth wide open and like. Well, uh, <laughs> I, 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 well, thank I, you. I'm gonna follow this up with Norway. Like, we don't have that much to be that proud about <laughs> when it comes to architecture. We got some mountains. It's not architecture. Well, mountains yeah, well, are we impressive. Don't, that's not architecture. Are you going to, like, <laughs> I theme this land here for Norway. It's a little hill. I'm sure, I'm sure you will think of something to make it amazing. I am really impressed. Especially, I, I like, the, the Buckingham Palace is great. The, the, the buildings are great. But I think, like, the bridge really sets it apart. It's like one of those, I don't know, it just feels really good. And it fits in really well. The station in there as well. Ah, oh, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, we're doing well. So, I think that's basically it for me this week. It's, as I say, a very short video, just an update of where we're up to. And... I will be back possibly in a week's time and I'll do a live stream because I, I normally do my live streams on a Saturday. So keep an eye out for that and I will probably finish this off in some sort of live stream. So next week, um, do you want to let us know what, what you'll be up to? Norway. Right. Yeah, I, I was planning to build something called a, uh, a stave church. I don't, I, probably definitely not what it's called in English. Uh, but... <laughs> It's a church which is uh, built in a very specific way. I've never seen yep. them anywhere other than Norway, and I figured, you know, they're kind of cool looking. Let's build one of those. Oh yeah, that'd be good. But then I, um, that's about, about as far as I've gotten with that. And then I figured, well, maybe Viking Age era kind of stuff. And then I realized that Sweden and Denmark were really the real Vikings, and then Norway just took the honor for it. So, yeah, maybe. <laughs> and that's about as far as I've gotten. I'll have some hills in there, probably. Hopefully. <laughs> I look forward I look forward to seeing it. I honestly do. I, maybe I should just make the Norwegian castle. Maybe. 
that would be good. Yeah, it'd be like one of the windows there. Yeah, we can have a face-off, can't we? So we've got Buckingham Palace on one side, you've got... Norwegian Palace. You've got Norwegian Castle on the other side. <laughs> yeah, on the other side. That might be that might be good. If we build it to scale, though, it's going to be one of the windows on Buckingham Palace. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brilliant. Okay, right, I think that's us done for this week, then. Yeah. So... I'd like to say thank you very much to everybody for watching. Um, if you are enjoying the series, then leave a comment, leave a like. Um, it does really help us to get inspired of where we're going to go next with the series. So thank you very much for watching and bye for now. Cheerio.